In this how-to, we will look at using the Active Spaces graphical interface to examine details. In a terminal window, navigate to the ASMM directory within your Active Spaces home directory and launch ASMM.jar. Wait for the message that indicates ASMM has started. Once it's started, launch a browser, we're using Firefox, and navigate to localhost port 8686. You need to connect to your Metaspace, so enter the details, in this case Metaspace name TAS301, Discovery URL is 50001 and the listen URL 50000. Discovery URL and listen URL are optional. Once you've connected, you should see your metaspace and any spaces within it. In the browser, click on the name of your metaspace and details will be displayed on the right hand side, including your discover and listen URLs. If we start another agent, so in a terminal window, run AS agent to connect to the Metaspace, give the name Agent1, when we look back in our browser, we see Agent1 is listed. Next, we will run our JavaScript to insert some tuples into our metaspace. Once we've done this we can look at our charts. This shows us a date timestamp of exactly when the Java program is running and terminating. Let's start another AS agent, this time named Agent 2. Return to your browser and we'll see we have Agent 1 and Agent 2. Look at the way the entries are spread between the two seeders. Start another agent, Agent 3. And in our browser, select the Members tab, and this shows us how the entries are spread between those seeders. If you look at the Distribution tab in the Graph area, you'll see the distribution between the agents. And the historical stat chart shows the historical data for the three agents again. You can find more training material and other resources at activespaces.tibco.com and you can communicate with other TIBCO users at tibcommunity.com and you can find other training options at 10.tibco.com. Thanks for watching. 